Hey everyone, I'm Karen and this is Chosen and Precious Bar. And in today's video, I'm going to show you how I built by myself this bed right here. I'm going to show you little bits and pieces of how I built it. It was long. It was long. It wasn't hard. There's a bad rep with Ikea that all of their stuff that you have to build by yourself are completely horrible and it's super hard to build by yourself but the instructions were pretty clear there were no words in the instructions just pictures but they were pretty clear uh, but if you're not paying attention it's very easy to mess up and I did mess up at one point and so then I had to go ahead and fix it and then get back on camera but I'm going to show you a little bit of me uh, building it and then I'll show you little bits of the bed itself Okay, we are ready. So behind me, right here, I have all of our, all of the pieces to the Amnes bed that we got in Ikea. And I'm gonna open everything up here in the living room and open up the mattresses that are here and then we're gonna start building. I'm gonna leave that in the plastic so it doesn't get dirty just in case. This bed is a day bed and it brings two mattresses because it's a day bed, but it's a pull out day bed. Those are both inflating. One here, one in the kitchen. I'm going to assume that that is a 72 hour inflation time. We had bought a foam mattress originally when my husband and I got married and we had to let it inflate for 72 hours. So I'm just going to assume that those both are. And while it's inflating, let's open up the boxes. What follows is a brief construction montage.
five hours later. We hope you enjoyed this brief construction montage. So this bed is the Emmys bed from Ikea. I am going to leave in the show notes in the description down below a link to the one that we got. We um, specifically went to a store in Ikea and bought it in person because we wanted to see it in person as well just to make sure that it's exactly what we wanted for this room. It is a day bed. It also pulls out so it can sleep more than one person on it. When we bought it, we didn't really realize that there was a weight limit on it, but there is. It has, I think it's 240 pounds closed and 200 pounds open. So um, this is going to be ideal for our daughter and for our nieces and nephews and um, any other kids that come here and stay with us or sleep over and stuff like that. Uh, it's perfect because it has the drawers that open. So she has plenty of storage in here. This room is pretty tiny, so there's not a lot of room for um, storage. So that was one of the things that we completely loved about this bed and actually is the thing that um, made us decide that this is the one that we wanted. All right, here is the bed. It has the cabinets here, or the drawers, should I say. Wrong word. Three of them, they are pretty deep in there. So they pretty much go almost the full length of the bed. The bed has plenty of support and then it does have two mattresses when combined I think it does like six inches but they're each about three inches thick very pretty Thank you for watching this video. As always, I'm so happy that you guys are all here. Like, subscribe, comment, hit the bell notification, do all of those things. Thank you so much for watching again and God bless you. Bye.